Hi, I'm T. Cooper and I'm a New York City based makeup artist, hairstylist and also co-founder of beauty and grooming company Metro Look. Today I'm going to show you how to do an Amanda Bynes updo. My model's hair has already been prepped. We did wispy curls all throughout her hair with a one inch curling iron. For this look, what you're going to need is some hairspray, a comb for sectioning and possibly teasing and some hairpins. What I'm gonna do is I love her fringe, so I'm gonna leave her fringe out, and on a lot of Amanda's hairdos, she leaves her fringe out as well. So I'm just gonna give this a little twist and leave her fringe out. Now I'm gonna gather the hair on the top section, back comb it six times to create some volume. Then I'm gonna push it up and pin it. So we have a nice voluminous crown. And crisscross your pins just to keep it nice and secure. Then you can start by, there's a hairstyle that she had where she just took hairs from both sections and just crisscrossed them on top of each other and it makes for such a beautiful hairstyle that took barely any effort. So you take some hair from this side, you cross it over, and then you pin it upward. You take some hair from this style, side, you cross it over, and you pin it upward. Repeat the process two more times. You take some hair from this side, can smooth it if necessary. You cross it over and you pin it. One more time, cross the hair from this side over to this side. You take the rest of hair that you have, you twist it, and since it's already curly, there's not much more you need to do. And then you pin it right up top. And you can crisscross your pins, but this big pin, it feels pretty secure. And if you have any little curls left over, you can pin them into place for a nice, pretty updo. Spray it just to make sure it stays secure throughout the day, and then you're done. I'm T. Cooper, and I just showed you how to do a fun, easy, beautiful Amanda Vines updo.